Hi, hello, hello, madam. How are you? Welcome back to my channel, Govind English Teacher. Today, a person uh, from uh, Pakistan. Actually, I don't know her. So, please, madam, uh, introduce yourself first of all. Uh, this is Sadia from Pakistan, and uh, I'm learning English, so that's why I have watched uh, so many videos of yours. Uh, that's why I contact you to talk with you because um, uh, this conversation is so good to improve our English. So I want to be a confident person. I think it is very necessary to talk one to one. Yes, nice, madam. Thank you for your uh, good words towards my channel. And uh, you have been watching my channel. Uh, thank you uh, for your uh, appreciation. And uh, uh, today, madam, let us talk uh, about our uh, your English language journey. Madam, uh, what were you? Yeah. So, did you work as a teacher? Uh, <clears throat> earlier, I was uh, working as a teacher in a school, but uh, after getting married and, you know, it's, uh, it's not uh, bearable for me to go to teach. Uh, but uh, I want to uh, learn English. Uh, it, it was my very, uh, you know, uh, first uh, desire. So uh, after pandemic, I was doing nothing. Uh, so I, I was thinking, what should I do? Then I got to know some groups and uh, then uh, I started reading and something. But I joined many groups and from this group, I, I, I can speak better. So, but this journey is going on. Uh, I need to speak more. I need to be fluent. Uh, so journey is going on. It's very necessary because uh, learning never ends. So, how long time have you been uh, practicing uh, communication skills or practicing English language? Uh? Yes, it has been uh, two years. I am working on two years. So, uh, but uh, sometimes I feel that oh my God, I am not uh, uh, good enough uh, when it comes to speaking. So, I uh, I thought I should do something. Uh, so I started uh, reading books, reading magazine, watching te television. Because uh, if you don't read, so you cannot uh, make a sentence. Or uh, listening is very important because it's a very basic uh, skills. You have to uh, be aware of that. People don't think about it. But uh, now I have started uh, listening BBC News, BBC Channel, whatever channel I have in my, on my TV. So uh, I started watching. So I think uh, if you want to learn English, uh, these things are very important. Uh, yes, madam. I think you have been uh, involved. You have been immersed into that uh, English environment by watching uh, English channels, by interacting with English people. Uh, some groups are there. And those who are passionate to learn English language, just uh, they drop the message that they are free. Then we can contact them. We can uh, enhance our uh, experience in speaking. Like that, I think you too learn, you know, because some platforms are there, some WhatsApp groups are there, and they are very good groups. And uh, th where we can uh, uh, enrich, where we can shine, where, where we can enhance our English language uh, uh, speaking ability, that's uh, the good, madam. That yeah, I think you two uh, learn like that, and uh, you have been watching English uh, channels. That's also good. Okay, madam. When you were a teacher, and uh, uh, what are the classes you? Thought. Actually, I used to teach subjects like English, Urdu, Maths, and uh, grade 1 to grade uh, 8. Uh, but after that, I realized that I, I must improve my English because I uh, in future, I want to be a language teacher. Uh, or speaking is very crucial for, uh, for a language teacher. So that's why uh, I am here. And the um, journey is going on because uh, it's very necessary to immerse yourself in because we don't have an environment to speak. Uh, of course, my, my background was Urdu medium. Uh, but now, uh, because of this, uh, I was I watch English content on YouTube. A lot of things I'm doing uh, along with uh, these things. So it is very necessary. Yeah, good madam. What you're doing a great job. Because you want to be an English teacher. For that only, you have been practicing. You are trying to polish your language of English language learning. That's good. And uh, I think the, you know something about how to learn English language. So my question is, and what are the suggestions? What are the tips that you are going to give uh, new learners? The many learners are there. 
then when your beginners are there they want to improve their communication skills and according to your experience what are the things one has to practice one has to uh, mind to be a good speaker to be a good communicator please uh, give some suggestions uh, to the new learners of communication skills okay um, i'm also a beginner as well <laughs> so yeah. when i was started uh, learning speaking uh, it was very uh, bad day because uh, i was so much uh, you know um, shivering uh, when i started uh, using this uh, groups and i was talking with someone so it, he was also a beginner so <laughs> it was relief for me uh, yeah. then i started uh, because it is fear fear can uh, you have to control your fear in any case because if you want to improve yourself you should be uh, confident whether uh, uh, whether you are uh, beginners or advanced because uh, uh, sometime you get nervous it is natural so i think i would say that you must keep on doing every day talk to someone read whatever you can do immerse yourself in english uh, content or environment so i would say that i am also a uh, when i started learning uh, it was very not good whatever you are doing because uh, it is your first step and if you if you fail if you so it's not a big deal because fail give you a courage so i would say that you must keep on working on your english learning first of all one has to create english environment and also second step uh, step is so one has to involve yeah immerse into that uh, environment of english language so that uh, anybody can learn a language by creating environment by involvement by interaction by practicing by focusing like this and uh, talk with like minded people one can enrich one's uh, language ability and speaking skills that's good madam nice nice when you when you are learning uh, fear of english is a common problem for every beginner because you know the fear of english that what we call anglophobia so many a people have the, the same problem but by practice day by day one can overcome anglophobia yes like that so uh, did you face any problem when uh, when you are talking with uh, new persons yes i uh, i used to feel very bad i used to feel that i words are not coming in my mind and what should i do but uh, of course uh, i used to watch uh, youtube videos a lot and uh, try to uh, listen to them because it is our not our native language we have to learn somehow so we have to uh, then i i sometime i write something uh, whatever the other person was saying in english uh, videos so i want to write so that and then i will uh, uh, remember memorize it that's why i in this way i have uh, uh, learned english uh, thank you madam because uh, in the beginning in initial says one has to by heart uh, sentences or phrases which are important which are very very important to, in our day to day work up we have to memorize we have to use so by using the small the important day to day work up life so by using by practicing and uh, we can learn any language not only english language and uh, this is very very important so first of all one has to be determined to learn something so it may be english whatever it may be so by our determination makes everything and uh, we can learn anything with a passion with a de- determination with burning desire with practice uh, with like minded people uh, thank you sadia madam for coming to my live session uh, giving uh, good uh, advice regarding communication skill thank you see you later madam bye thank you sir